get away with this. I really wouldn't do this if I were you. Let's call it a misdeal, okay? And know where to get to it. Hey, it's Francine's party, right? for you. Cash me out, buddy. Coming budding superstar actress. Oh, well, welcome, up and coming budding superstar actress. Mm -hmm. You know, there are a lot of people you can talk with. Thank you. Hey, do me a favor, keep an eye on your dealer, because oh. I almost killed him five minutes ago. Uh -oh. All right, I'm on it. Okay. So nice to meet you here. <laughs> Don't want to give up. Sweetheart, would you mind helping out with the of course I'm friend. Happy birthday. Well, thank you, sweetheart. Take care. Yeah. How long have we known each other? I don't know, Tony. Four years? Okay, have I ever told you, like, how I even got into this? No. Okay, mm. now don't you laugh at me, because I used to be your age. I had a dream too. I don't laugh. I wanted to be a singer. Yeah. And I was damn good. But I ain't complaining. I've got a good life. And I haven't hurt anybody in a few weeks. My point is if you have a dream, I want you to go out there and I want you to grab it. And if you gotta shove some people aside, cause you're gonna have to do it. That's it. I love you, kid. Yeah, you're gonna like this. Oh, thank you. Mars. We're here tonight for a very special occasion. We're here to celebrate Francine's 29th birthday. Again. <laughs> so, Francine, from the bottom of my heart, baby, I hope you win the lottery. Oh, cheers! Oh. The best I can do. 
You know, he Thank says you. this every year. <laughs> Thank you, Tony. Thank you. And thank you, everyone, for joining me at the ranch on this very special occasion. Hi. Nice party. It really is, isn't it? Are you having a good time? I think so. Well, life is what you make it. I heard you know Matt Damon. What's he like? Taller than I thought. Nice party, huh? Yeah, yeah, it really is. I heard you know Matt Damon. What deal? Did you know that? Taller than I thought. That's exactly what I heard. Hey, how's it going? Good. Mike? Is that your name, Mike? Yeah. Listen, Mike, uh, I need to tell you something. I run a straight establishment here. Hmm? These are my friends. You get my drift? What would you like to do? I'm an actress. I'd love to get an agent, start getting some auditions, making real money. You know, there might be someone here that can help you. Happy birthday again. Actually, my birthday was six days ago, on the third. Oh, did you know that in Buddhism, the number nine is the karmic cycle for completion? Really? I didn't know that. It's when you can either learn from your experiences and move on to learn new things and have better experiences, or not. Are you a Buddhist? <laughs> no. So, are you having a good time? It's okay. You know, life is what you make of it. I've heard that. I also heard that Matt Damon's a lot taller than people think he is. Yeah, I've heard that too. I'm 17. Well, 29 for the 20th time or whatever it is. I mean, she's racking it up. She's a great person, though. Oh, hello. Uh, my name's Chris, and uh, this is Stasia. Desmond and uh, Joe. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Oh, and this couch potato is bum dog. Sorry, did he say your name was Don? No, bum dog. I'm sorry, what? Bum dog. Think of a bum on the street and then a dog. Bum dog. Are you kidding? No, I'm not. Why? Why what? Why is your name bum dog? Because I'm a bum. You're a bum. Yes, I am. You, you live on the street, you're yes, homeless. Yes, 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 that is true. Then how did you get invited to this party? Believe me, this party is the last place in the world I want to be. But Francine's a friend of mine. Sleep in her parking lot. I don't believe you. Francine, do, do you know this guy? Oh, I have known bum dog for years. One day I was taking my trash out to the dumpster and I heard this big thump and his head popped out. He was sleeping in the dumpster. So I gave him a meal and we got to talking. I found out, of course, what a sweet guy he is. And we've been friends ever since. Well, I apologize. You were not lying. 
Why would I lie about something like that? <laughs> it just, I, I feel weird calling you bum dog. It just seems so disrespectful. Listen, I don't need or even want your respect. Either accept me the way I am, or you know what? There's plenty of other places you can sit. <laughs> Are you kicking me off this couch? No, no, no. Me couch, to couch. Oh, thank you, I think. Feels good to get that bum dog seal of approval. Send no more. Yeah, <laughs> okay. I'll try not to do that. So, bum dog, how long have you been? Been a bum? Yeah. Most of my adult life. Even before that, I was a teenager, which is the same thing as being a bum. And how did you become this way? Well, really, I always wanted to be a bum. I don't believe you. Yeah, that's true. When I was a kid, I used to go to school and I used to see these bums on the street. They didn't have to go to school, they didn't have to work, they didn't have to do anything but sleep there on the sidewalk all day long. And I thought, man, that's what I want to do with my life. And so afterwards, I started reading books on Buddhism and Jack Kerouac novels, and I thought, yeah, this is the way I want to live my life. Yeah. And so the legend of bum dog began. <laughs> you do kind of have this whole zen bum thing going on. At least you're honest about it. So what do you do? I'm an escort. I'm sorry, what? I'm an escort. You know, prostitute, call girl, a hooker, a bar girl. Wow, you're honest about it. Yeah, I actually don't usually tell people about it like that. <laughs> yeah, right. No, really, I, I don't. It's just, you've been so honest with me, it's kind of hard not to be honest back. Okay, well, how long you been a uh, bar girl, escort, uh, hooker, prostitute? <laughs> I can't believe I'm telling you all of this. Uh, since I was a teenager, my mother was a bar girl in Panama, and my dad was an American sailor. I don't know who he was. And this is something you always wanted to do? Oh, hell no. Unlike you and your bum career, this is not something I always had the urge to do. My, actually, my mother sent me to this international school because she wanted something better for me than what she had, but then she died, and I was the best looking of all my sisters, so the job kind of fell on me. It was either that or watch my whole family starve, and that wasn't an option. Instead of pursuing what I wanted to do with my life, which was become a lawyer, I took on the family business. I was so young and stupid at the time. If I knew then what I know now, I'm sure I would have gotten out of it, but too much time has passed. Knowing what I know now isn't actually helping me right now. That's the way life is. You rarely see it in the moment. You usually only see it clearly after you're no longer living it. <laughs> By then it's no good. Well, that depends. You still have the same problems you had back then? In some ways, yes. Well, then what you know now about then can still help you now. Complete or repeat? Huh? Topaz! Topaz! We gotta go. Oh, okay. Um, this is Bum Dog. How you doing, Doug? No, not Doug. Bum Dog. Think of a bum on the street and then think of a dog. Okay. Bum Dog? We gotta go. Bye, bum dog. It was really nice talking to you. Oh, thank you so much for coming. Oh, I enjoyed it. Happy birthday again, and I hope the rest of the year goes great for you. Thank you, Topaz. I think it will. Yeah. For me, too. Hmm. Topaz. This is Amy and Nancy, 
and they are both up and coming budding actresses. Hi, are you an actress too? No, I am a bar girl. <laughs> Excuse me, what did you say? Bar girl. Think of a bar where you order a drink and then think of a girl as in female. Bar girl. You know, I meet men in bars and have sex with them for money. And Antonio is my pimp. <laughs> Excuse me. You should be winning. People know your name. You should be winning. Playing a winner's game. You should be winning. Mm. There you go. Good luck. Mm. Mm. Your name? Um, Anne Marie. Anne Marie Lopez. Anne Marie Lopez. Anne Marie. Oh, thank you. Anna Marie Lopez. Ah, first year student. Mm -hmm. Got it. Thank you. Good luck. You should be winning. People know your name. You should be winning. Playing a winner's game. You should be winning. Make your life like mine. People shake your hand and welcome you in Before you know it, you got a new friend You should be winning Laughing, having fun, you should be winning Dancing in the sun, you should be winning Make your life like mine Here's the real story and you know it's true Money, money, money Hello I won what? <laughs> Hi. I'm Topaz. 